And we are back. Pyro Bully Shogun. Follow my shit. Follow me on Instagram, on TikTok. It's all the same shit. Pyro Bully underscore Shogun. Blow that shit up. This hey, is The hey, Last I'm of Us sorry, 2. I, I totally overslept. Review I Breakdown guess. Part 2 Would right there. That dude, Asian dude, Jesse. Other girl, that's Ellie. I... You will understand how amazing this me. game is. I must me. also implore she you to me. watch these videos, but don't let suffering. me spoil everything Just for you. Game. You need to get this game, play this game. This is amazing. Amazing creation, up, man. It's just... It's just otherworldly how good She's this stuff is, man. Right? Ain't a movie out know. there. There ain't nothing on Netflix this good. No, the Witcher 3 series on, on Netflix is actually you, really good. There's some good stuff on there, but I'm just saying, like, this is an experience, man. I'm about to wreck some zombies, man. Let's get into this. So here we are, boys. Girls... This is Ellie. I believe she's 19 years old. She's a beast. Absolute warrior. Potty tenant. I just got to get a few supplies from this room. And then we're going to go talk to some people. Man. This PS4 is allowing me to capture shit now. I don't know. I know we didn't tell me this before. I'm a little bit uneducated on a lot of this shit. You know, I'm just throwing shit together here. Thank goodness for my girlfriend. We're learning together, you know? This channel is about to blow up. Boy, this video is going to be dope. Don't be changing the channel on this. I've been watching YouTube videos for a while now. This one's going to be one of the greats. YouTube might boot me after this video right here, boy. Melee, don't be running around this house, girl. This dialogue might uh, echo a bit. It's just about to get out. I'm a rook here. I was. However, you got everything. Also, yes. too, guys, watch my uh, watch my uh, pyrography video on how I uh, the wood burning video on that on the last was drip that I made. You're the talk of the town this Maybe if I get like <sighs> 75 <laughs> likes on this Let video, this so like this, this video, Jeez. comment to me. Why you like The Last of Us 2 or don't like The Last of Us 2? And uh, put something funny, man. If I find something funny, I will send you that drip. So like, subscribe, and leave a comment. Once I get 75 likes, I will ship that drip off to you. I just got to throw some resin on that bad boy, and I'll ship it off for free and everything. So 75 likes, you got to comment. Comment maybe like comment done, and uh, make sure you subscribe. And I'll go and I'll take the time. I'll look at it all. Hey, so you gotta make me laugh though, probably, or I say something pretty fucked up, you know, or something really good, man. Because, like, you know, this is ultimately a review video, a review series. I want to break down, review, just get it done, you know, just get it done. Look at these kids, man. Look at these horses. Everybody's having fun. I don't see why they don't just leave us here for a while. Just let us kind of like... Just let us kick back, you know? For a while. Dog? Huh. What a cute dog, man. I got five dogs, man. You'll see them dogs whenever you follow my Instagram and my TikTok. Oh, snowman. All these kids having a great time over here. Awesome. Fireplace. This is nice, man. Look at this, man. After you play part one, man, you, you're in here and you're like, God damn, they're doing this. You know? Because out there, boys and girls, zombies out there. Infected. Scary too, man. Just, just terrifying. Look at the abundance of meat over here. Look at these cuts, man. Oh, yeah. You know what's messed up, man? You can go to Albertsons right now. And they don't got meat like this, man. Look at all that ground. 
That lean Wagyu beef. Morning. Eh. That could be like maybe like elk ground or there's some Piscal up there. Piscal. Oh wow! Hey, Justin. Oh, hi. That little dude right there gonna be a butcher whenever he grows up, man. This is awesome. So I watched that uh, state of play today from Sony. Not impressed, Sony. You dropped the ball on that one. I'm not excited about anything on that showcase today, man. Comment me on that, man. It is a bit disappointing. I'll forgive everybody. You know, I'll forgive Xbox for their downfall. My uh, Sony. Excuse me. Nintendo, man. I haven't played nothing from Nintendo in years. My boy Akimo says he's hooked on that Switch, man. I uh, maybe one of these days I'll get it and see if I can play a little kitty game. Maria! Seth. This dude right here, man, you Seth could tell he's a snake. Look, I don't think I would allow this dude. Well, maybe not. You could, there's an underlining kindness there. You could tell he kind of feels bad about what he said, what he's done. I don't know. It's hard to judge this guy. Sure. You know, what, what does he do whenever nobody's watching? Say, that's that's what I'm wondering. Although, with them steak sandwiches, man, you, you know, you give me a steak sandwich, a lot's forgiven. Made you some sandwiches. It's got to be perfect, though. You know, the bread's got to be toasted. I mean, it could be lean. I'm not, I'm just because I'm a fat boy doesn't mean I want a fat boy sandwich. It could be toasted with coconut yeah. oil. A lean cut of beef, fat-free cheese, yep. even vegan cheese, man. I appreciate Maybe that. some sliced up bell peppers, jalapenos, that. preferably that hatch it's green chili. Mm. I mean, New Mexico people it's know what I'm talking about there. The that hatch sure. green chili, man. Ah. It's fine. You walk you out. I'm sure you're not hearing none of this, but it's awesome. This is just kind of fluff right here, you know. Um, I don't got a problem with any of it. It's just so, I mean, you just can't do nothing here. They should let me talk to people. Naughty dog. You know, let me sit over here, play some cards. Maybe whoop everybody's ass in a game of darts. Maybe there's a pool table somewhere I could kick some ass there. Let's go. You're playing this game, you're like, man, give me a zombie, man. Give me a zombie and some bullets, naughty dog. You go up to the Northwest Lookout. You're scheduled to arrive later today. I love this game, man. It's so awesome. I was gonna check just, out the creek trail. Just look at it, guys. I'll need someone else to come. You adults out there that are, you yeah, know, my you friends know, and family that are watching these videos really. right now. Before you get real tired of me. Done it a I, I, look at these. Look at these. Is this school at night? Hopefully these, hopefully these children are learning. You know, future of tomorrow. Developers of tomorrow got to protect the kids. Protect the kids, people. Always watch your kids. Ellie, can I talk to you for a sec? All right, Maria. So, look, I don't know what's going on with you and Julie. Maria, guy really cares about you. And I'm sure he didn't mean to. See, this, is a this is a valid conversation right yeah. here, man. And as an adult, sometimes okay. you got to tell people shit, you okay. know? Sorry to pry. Even if you don't want to, man. Thanks. Yo, Dina. Assignment. <clears throat> Give me a minute. This here is Dina. Jesse's ex-girlfriend. But I kind of got a little feeling that she's feeling Ellie right now. Hey, Dina. And that's Can cool, you? you know? <laughs> hey, guys. What is out. that? Oh, my God. Mealy drinking gallons of water. I could hear that. <laughs> Mila drinking water, I could hear it through my headphones. Hey, hey. This girl, um, Dina, man, her real name is Casina. Find her on YouTube. Uh, her YouTube's blowing oh, up, man. Okay. I think I she's got a great it. personality, but it's like I just, I she's, you know, they used an actual water. girl for this face. And uh, it just it blows your mind whenever you see her, man. And her personality's great. 
They should have used your voice. I'm not bagging on the voice they did use, but uh, had I met Casino one time, I'd be like, oh yeah, let's I'm, let's be in this game. I would have put her alongside Ashley Johnson and just let him let him go, you know. But yeah, follow her, man. She's she's a great watch. Very entertaining. Ow! What the fuck? I'm not even playing. Cause you're a chicken. These boys about to get their asses whooped. Although I haven't done this in about a couple of weeks now. This is really just like raw gameplay for me because I conquered this game, then I conquered Days Gone, and then I've been playing uh, Ghost of Tsushima. So I don't know what I'm doing, but uh, we'll give it a go. Little one's Boom, falling apart on me. Little shit. <laughs> Ow. I know where you live, Alex. <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> oh, what a shot. Come on, yeah. I'm Eat telling you, man, the first time I did that. Hey, how do you run on this game? <laughs> no. get her. I already Help forgot. Me. Well, did you change your running, uh, like the running mechanics here? Oh, so I bet running is L1, huh? I guess I asked for that, huh? Yep. Okay, well, we'll I'm gonna What's find that? out. I wonder why it wouldn't just be map to L3 anyway. You know what I'm saying? It almost seems like the better way to play it. Jesse wants us to do the trails. He's yeah. Joel and Tommy. Although, I mean, you can't complain about what they've done in this game. You can play it however you want. Like Hats off to Naughty Dog. Morning, girls. Morning. That's why you couldn't play part one, right? Because you couldn't get to that L1 button. I can't wait till these Thank people you. can see you play, Booth. You're going to knock their socks off. And I'd be interested if there's anybody else out there playing the way you play. I bet once once this shit starts popping off, we're gonna have controller companies coming at you like, "Hey, we got the controller for you. Send in free shit, Naughty Dog. Send me some free shit, Alaga." Alaga is like, "Come on, over here in Nuevo Mac." But yeah, you freak out. I, I conquered this, then I went to Days Gone. Who? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Dina, actually, my girlfriend was just reminding me to let you know. Dina, later on in the game, she mentions that her family is from Look New Mexico. Yeah, That's where yeah, we're yeah. from. One and then she, she mentions, too, that there's a faction in New Mexico, pretty much a group of crazies. Well, maybe they're not crazy. Maybe they're super nice. But they, Open it up. they're called the Ravens, and they're from New Mexico. Down, so I'm Joe. pretty excited about that. All right. You all know the drill. This is good stuff right routes, here, man. Mark your log books, clear any infected you see. You run into any. Yeah, it makes you, you wonder though, like why are they sending out these young, like 19, 18 year old kids? Whenever there seems to be a bunch right. of like I mean I know Ellie's a beast, right? And Dina's a beast too, but like there's a bunch of men just hanging around. Well look, that guy those guys are going out. I, I've heard people argue like why is Joel and Tommy going out on watch whenever they're kind of like I mean they're like essentially the president vice president of the you know what I'm saying like they're the leaders of the I think I mean it seems like Maria is like head in charge see here man this is a part of the game whenever you first play this game it switches you over to this scene right here and it's like you're like what the hell is going on like you we never see these characters in part one. 
And so all you want to do, you get you, The Last of Us 2 comes out, and you're like, oh man, I can't wait. You know, I want to play as Joel, I want to play as Ellie, whatever. <laughs> and then you got to play as Abby. This right here, this is Abby. She's a real bruiser of a female. You'll see once she, once she, once you start controlling her, you'll see just how much of a beast she really is. I mean, it would take me a solid three months of training. I'd probably have to take some steroids in them three months, and I'd probably have to go to like, I don't know, train at like Jackson's or something to to, to beat this girl in a fight. I mean, she would kick the shit out of me. Look at this girl. Now, there's a lot of talk on the internet about whether or not this is possible and natural. Well, I mean, I think you'd get a lot of mixed reactions to a question of that nature. Do I think it's possible and natural? Yeah. I mean, she's big, but she's not bodybuilder big. You know what I'm saying? She's like a, she's like a, she's like an off-season bikini girl. Or, I mean, way off-season, but like, she's big, but it's not out of control big. On camera, it looks that way, especially sometimes the angle in which you're playing her. She's thick, man, but you see these thick girls all the time. Genetics are a motherfucker, man. You don't know how big somebody can get. I mean, they're not going to get like Mr. Olympia big, but she ain't close to stepping on the Mr. Olympia cool. stage. Come on, people. You sure you don't want to do this when the sun's out and it's warmer? She's working hard, you know? Abby's out there on that grind. And you don't want to just tell me? It seems like this boy right here who seems like a true softy. Although he's cool, he, uh, I think he got the hots for old Abby. And I mean, if you're into that kind of thing, that's fine. What are you doing wandering around out here? Yeah, so L1 is to run, huh? Boogs, did you find any quarters over here in the snow? I feel like the farther south we go, the prettier it's got. You're gonna have to help me find these quarters, girl, because I don't want to be playing this shit and not find any damn quarters. My girlfriend found a New Mexico quarter, y'all. Yeah, She's been looking all over this shit. Whenever I play games like this, man, I'm just not that dude. I'm not. I mean, I look, I look hard, man, but I'm looking for a fight, boys and girls. You know, let me see a zombie. Let me just smash that thing. You did all this in the dark. Yes. Now come on. Let's just let's just look at this environment, man. Look at that. You can't tell me there ain't a Sasquatch in here. I'm a firm believer in Sasquatch, man. I kind of always have been. If you watch it, the, if you watch the Patterson Gimlin footage of Bigfoot, man, and you don't think that that's a real living, breathing creature, I just don't know what you're looking at. You know what I'm saying? Because go look at, after you watch this video, to its completion, go Keep watch like the Patterson Gimlin footage, and you'll see this female Sasquatch okay. walking through the forest in Bluff, Cle Bluff Creek, California. And she is just out. exquisite, man. I'm not being weird. Has big breasts, but you could just see the girth on her. Like this girl would smash at you, man. And I bet Patty wasn't taking no damn steroids. She just got them genetics, you know? But yeah, go look at that Patterson Gimlin footage and tell me this. Have you ever seen a costume that good? Do you think we could replicate that video today? Because nobody's replicated it yet. I mean, you might say, oh, Planet of the Apes. But shit. That Planet, the Planet of the Apes of Mark Wahlberg, maybe. Or, you know, the newer shit that they make, but... Oh my god, no! If you can do it, I can um, do it. It's just not the same, man. Go look at Patty Boy. Girl. Ouch. It's time for you to realize. I'll be as graceful as you. Really? What is that? See, I feel the government it's too can't to... Oh, babe, it's Come Kobe's on. turn. Mila was out there for like an hour and a half a little while ago. Kobe's out here. 
If you don't want to go out, you can just... No! Hey. No! Eyes on me. The dogs have almost Abby. killed me once again. Stop looking down. Let's stop fucking around here, Abby. Yeah. Shit ain't that hard. Although, I don't want to be looking down a cliff like that. Look at that. Mm. Although, Abby's afraid of heights. Me. You'll, you'll, you'll see that later on in the game. On She's terrified of heights. You know? work my foot Some of ass. us are men. Abby, stop flirting. Some of us are afraid of heights. Introduce the quarters until later on. Babe! Quarters have always been around. My girlfriend said they don't introduce the quarters until later on. But quarters are older than we are, my love. <laughs> Victoria's over here telling me to shut up. The audacity. Does it? Rainy, you're a sweet girl, Rain. Rainy, man, my blue American. I got a lot of videos on Rainy whenever she had her litter. Oh, boys, girls, go look at Rainy, man. She is... She's just gorgeous, man. Not overly muscular, but whenever you see it in real life, it's like she's just first. so beautiful, you know? So the first time you're playing this game, man, you're over here wondering, it's like, why are these people looking at Jackson's, right? What are they up to? Like, do they want to live there? Maybe they want to challenge us to some kind of game or something? But then you see this girl go a little bit crazy. Look at her. Okay. Look at how crazy she is. Assuming he's in there. There's something wrong with this chick, you know? Maybe it's good. Maybe it's bad. Who you knows? Corner one of the patrols and get confirmation, and then I don't know. But judging on the way she's acting right now, I don't think I'd want to hang out with this gal. Yeah. Okay. I'm sure, that'd be happy to offer. I mean, maybe if you want to lift some weights or something, well, you know, I'd be like, hey, yeah, I'll lift some weights with you. But you hear yourself. I don't want to like. Okay, what do you want to do? Watch a movie or anything. Look at the attitude. What is going on with you? I would be like, listen, Abby, let's just slow it down here a little bit. Let's just cool down. I don't know what you're trying to do. Mel's pregnant. Oh. Uh. Look at this. That was a weird animation. That's one of the only weird animations in the game. Whenever she shakes her face and it kind of like distorts a little bit. I don't give a shit about that. I'm not going to deduct any points for that. Not at all. I knew I couldn't count on you. Happy. I want what you want. Not at any cost. Hey. Don't. So the first time you're playing this game, man, you just don't know what's going on here. You know, this whole time I'm playing this part, Excuse I'm like, man, when am I going to get back to Ellie, man? I got to buy it. 60 bucks to be playing as this big old girl. You know, I mean, she's cool. Maybe I'll like her once I get to know her. I don't know. I don't know about this chick, man. You know what I'm saying? How do you do? How do you guys and girls feel about about uh, Abby? I kind of think she's a little bit crazy, man. Upon first, upon first playing this, I'm like, ah, what's wrong with this girl? I tell you what, man. On this series right here, though, they just kind of leave it up to you on where to go. And then you kind of find your way, man. You just go. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes you just got to go. It just comes, you know? You don't got to worry. But like, should I go here? Should I do this? It just kind of... It all depends, you know? I'm not sure there's any wrong way to go here. It all kind of connects. Maybe. Shit, maybe I went the wrong way. No, I didn't. That's what I'm saying, man. I just don't think you can uh, go the wrong way here. Or maybe you can. I don't know. I've only played it twice, you know. Right after this, I got into Days Gone. And I loved it, man. I, I almost like... I told I told my girlfriend, I was like, man, I need to play another game just so I stop thinking about this game so much. So then I get into Days Gone. I'm all about it. You know, you got your homie and stuff. Boozer. You're looking for your wife. You alive? So cool. And that's just kind of what it is, you know? Like, you kill a bunch of zombies. I love—I don't know what it is about zombies, man, but I just love killing zombies, man. 
a lot of people say like, oh, it's it's overplayed. You know, we've seen everything the zombie games have to offer. I disagree with that. Completely, wholeheartedly, I disagree with that. St keep on pushing out zombie games, developers. Although, as I was saying in a previous video, I wouldn't mind a damn Sasquatch game. You know? Maybe a, I've been talking about a Sasquatch uprising, right? With what's going on on the planet, all this craziness. I think at some point the Sasquatch is going to have to come out. They're going to be like, man, enough's enough out of you humans. We're going to start running this shit. Planet of the Apes style. Hopefully that doesn't happen, but maybe we can get our shit together. You know, it's sad, man, seeing all these bombings in the Middle East and shit. I just hope this stuff doesn't start happening over here, man. We don't, we don't need any more. What is around here, man? What up, what up, what's going on here, zombie? So right there, whenever you're playing that, remember to press X. Huh? So let's see, how do you dodge? How do you dodge? Bound? Punch? Bound? Oh, it's over for this dude. Man. <laughs> it's, it's hard to mess with me up. Whenever there's a dodge mechanic, man, I just get so good at that. I conquered The Witcher 3 with a dodge mechanic, man. Like, look at this thing. Get out of here. Come at me, son. This might be a fun man. That's so much fun, man. Where are the rest of them? Oh, yeah. The three hit combo. Oh! Boom! Oh, oh, oh my god! Get out of here! You know, so the other day, man, I, I've been, uh, I've been telling people, like, you know, I've been telling my girlfriend and my co workers and stuff. I find it weird how, like, I've never been somebody who, like, I don't remember my dreams. You know? So then I was listening to a Rogan podcast the other day. And he was talking to like a neuro, uh, neuro, neuroscientist, a brain doctor, right? And he was saying how like, pretty much I think like, like he was saying how if you don't, if you're not remembering dreams and, well, no, no, maybe dreams are all like determined by how much dopamine your brain is releasing. And like if your brain is releasing dopamine, you know, it's like whenever you dream, you're on psychedelics or something, right? And I thought, well, that's cool, you know? Like, dreaming is cool, but... And I do dream, but I don't remember the dreams. So not remembering dreams... I mean, and once in a while, I will, man. I'll remember dreams, right? Like, every once in a while, it will happen. So the other day, I had an experience. It's like once a month, man. I'll remember a dream. And most of the time is nightmares, right? So I was having this dream, and uh, so what happened was I was like on an island, and it was like, I, but I was confident, right? I was confident in the situation because it was a get out of here. It was uh, so it was a zombie apocalypse on an island, and it was a badass like city, right? The houses were real nice, kind of like. If San Francisco was on an island, right? Like that house uh, architecture, like a nice neighborhood. And uh, I had like, so so I had all the skill in the world, right? Like I was confident in the dream. I knew there was zombies. So I walked out the house. And like I said, I'm pretty much in San Francisco, a beautiful setting, the whole, the whole deal, right? And uh, I also knew for some reason I had like the punching ability and the reflexes of like an Anderson Silva or a Conor McGregor type, you know, somebody who's just real precise with that punch. So in the game, in the dream, I was a badass with the weapons, just like Ellie, but I could punch like Anderson Silva. So I'm in a situation in the dream where I, I come out of the house and I'm already like on the street, you know, and... Uh, gotta be close. I, uh, what happens? Hmm. Oh, yeah. So, like, these zombies start coming at me, and I realize right away, holy fuck, man. Like, I left my guns inside, right? 
So I left my guns inside and I'm like, what the fuck? But at the same time, I remember, wait, I could just fuck these dudes up. There's only like three of them, right? So a zombie, I start running and there's three zombies chasing behind me and there's one real close. So I turn around with the confidence of Anderson Silva to hit this thing right in the face. You know, I mean, Anderson's going to probably kick the shit out of 10 ordinary men, no problem. You know, as long as they don't have weapons and shit, like, he's going to beat the shit out of them, right? No problem. One punch knockouts, kicks to the face. It's going to be over. And uh, so I, I turn around from a full sprint to hit the one zombie that's right behind me. The plan was probably knockout, punch, one shot, and then maybe, like, a kick, and then another. You know, I was, I was going to knock these three zombies out and just kill them. So that initial turnaround, overhand right, I missed. Dream end. Man. It was terrible. But what about that for a game? Right? You're in a zombie apocalypse. Bullets are low. The whole deal. But you could fucking fight like an MMA fight. That's what I want to see, boys. Get it done. Get it done. So I mean, that was a good that was a good dream for me, you know. Even though I missed the punch, uh, I would I would have landed that next one. I shouldn't have missed the first one. But I don't know, man. Maybe that zombie had good reflexes or something, you know. These things happen, man. I guess you. It's kind of that situation where you win some and you lose some. So, if we're getting back to The Last of Us 2, man, I, I think, like, you know, what I'm trying to do here is get to a part where I can show you kind of exactly what what I'm talking about. Well, oh, no, no, no. I'm trying to get to a part that will illustrate to you... Um, how powerful this game is, man. Because it's strong, man. It's so strong, man. Oh, what, what was that? Brutality! You see that, man? That zombie left me two bullets, baby! Once again, boys and girls, follow me on TikTok. I just started that shit yesterday. It's popping. It's popping. I um, follow me on Instagram. It's all the same shit. Now make this video blow up, man. This is good shit. You know. I got this on moderate once again. I just want to show you guys a fun gameplay. Um, I'm hoping eventually, man. I I'll be playing like on um, Survivor, you know. I, I'm seeing some guys dominating on Survivor difficulty, man. Um, I just followed this dude or this chick the other day. Solid Perry, right? Solid Perry. And um, they're playing this game. It, it just, they're dominating, man, on like on Survivor. And you know, I I haven't given it a try, but. This is only my second playthrough right here, man. You know? Could I do it? Sure. I'm pretty confident I could, man. But it's like, I mean, could I do it on that level? I don't know, man. My aim has never been great. I'm not like a champion aimer. But, uh, but yeah, man, I'll give it a shot. You know, one of these days you'll see me playing that hard shit just popping off headshots. See, right here, man, right here. Okay, so we're going to switch back. Upon playing this the first time, you don't know. You're like, what? You know, what's going on here? So then you switch back to Ellie, and you're like, thank you. Thank you, God. Because this game is about Ellie and Joel, man. It's, it's, it's such a beautiful experience, you know? Look at this. Sony, you're doing it right. You're doing it right, Sony. 
I probably got about 20 more minutes here, guys, so let's see how far I can get. Well, maybe I'll cut it short, and then, you know, because I'm capturing all this on the PS4, so I'm not even sure if this is going to work. Or how bad the echo is going to be on the voice, so bear with me, man. This is good content. Good content here. Like I said, I've been watching a lot of YouTube videos, man, on gaming. And, uh... You know, it's all good shit. Like, I, yeah, I love so many people's content, man. I don't know. It didn't feel... You never really talked But I just want to bring you my version of shit. Yeah, you know, my thoughts. There isn't much to talk about. How stupid my thoughts are. I just, I, I got the one the thing that, that I think really like I could... I'll give you in the long run if you keep other. on watching my shit. Okay. Is that... You know, no, even I though I'm like, artist. I'm a bit of a troll, I've grown to like that I could be a years. bit of a dick. So I mean you. well, you know, I, I just want yeah, us all to like, be cool, you know? Interesting. Shut up. Okay. There's a good, there's something that, you know, you can be a good troll, and then you can be a bad troll. I'm always kind of trolling this, uh, you can tie it's not trolling, it's kind of like funny material. You'd have to see what I'm doing. Just like the other day, um, well, I couldn't even explain it, actually. It's this MMA page that I follow hey. on Instagram, and he put up you wanna see something this one post, and I put history. something, you know, kind of like Nothing is that spectacular. acting like a samurai oh, from uh, on, Ghost of Tsushima, and people just took it completely out of hand. Like, these people just don't know what's going on. Or, like, they just get so aggressive, and they take everything so seriously, you know? Sometimes you just gotta chill and be cool, you know? But, I mean, I understand I'm not gonna... Not everybody's gonna like what everybody else does. Hey, it's this way. I mean, it is what it is, you know? People like different shit, that's okay. I get real bothered with shit myself, to tell you the truth. I tell you, man, this segment man, here, you, huh? like this whole first part, you know, as you're playing this game, after you play the first one, you're That's like, you're just so happy to be back in it. So this whole first part, you know, it's 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 good. I mean, I think if this was just a DLC part, like all the part I've shown you so so far, I'd probably give it like a seven out of ten. But then, this game gives you a reason to care here in a minute that just absolutely breaks your heart. And it becomes oh, something mean, different, man. It's like, man, he was funny. you know, right now you're just oh, hearing yeah. me talking shit and stuff. But here in a while, you see something where you're like, you know, in video games, I'm not sure I've ever seen Tell anything quite like that. And, stuff. and it just, when it, it literally, it breaks your heart. But then at the same time, it makes you so mad that it'll carry you throughout the whole game. I mean, it'll carry you into the third game. You know what I'm saying? It'll it'll always weigh on you. Oh, I did that the first time I played too. What kind of shoes does Ellie have? Sign his head. What was this place? Uh, it used to be a radio tower. I can't really hear anything here. I got the TV down so low so that hopefully you guys won't get too much echo here. So, but I mean, I could read the caption, you know, that's, that's why I have it on. So I'll sign that here in a minute. Dina is looking out the window looking for infected. Or not infected for that matter. We haven't run into any infected as these two yet. Seems but it'll be exciting whenever we do out. because Dina, that chick over there, is a killer. And um, Ellie's 
pretty much probably like akin to I mean she's such a savage such a monster yeah oh some screws awesome you gotta pick up everything in this game man picked up that shit there's some stuff to pick up around here boy let me find everything in this room before I get out of this room. What is that? Oh my god. That's lovely. Look at that. Hey, I'm gonna guess this bong was your jeans. Yes, indeed. Hey, do you have any on you, actually? Beautiful. Just, just incredible. You know, with something like this, man, they should. They should allow you to use this, man. This could really help help out, you know? I mean, I'm sure they're devastated in this world, right? Zombies everywhere, fucking death. Death at every corner. Monsters, you know? Rapists, murderers, yeah, all of them. Just madness in this world. And this right here, if it had some of that magic stuff in it, could really help us all out. But, they don't want to allow us to have this stuff. And why isn't this stuff legal? You know, just recreationally across the planet. What the hell, man? You know, this could really help everybody out. I can't do this stuff anymore, boys and girls. And that's fine, you know. I can cope. I'm good, man. You know. But. The possibilities. I mean, I'd have been headshotting everybody in this review. If I could only have some of this stuff. You know. It's tough, man. The realities of life, you know. They're trying to take away what God has given us, man. Am I the only one who feels this way? You know what I'm saying? Alright, guys. What happened to Cobes? Can I leave him alone? Yeah, yeah I, I think they'll be fine right now. But I'm going to go ahead and end this. Um, fans of Pyro Bully Shogun, my 40 followers, I love you guys. Stay strong. And uh, I may record another one tonight, man, so you may get two of them. I just, I, we got to see if this one's going to work. So, uh, like, subscribe, and like I said, man, if we can get 75 likes, thumbs up, right? The thumbs up, subscribe. If you've already subscribed, make sure to like and comment. And whatever comment I like most, comment done, and then give me a reason why you don't like this game or you do like this game. And I'll send that drip to whichever comment I like most, man. So, uh, I'll catch you all in a while, man. Thanks for watching. Stay healthy and uh, stay alive. Stay alive.